Hey everybody, this is Josh from Musalesson.com coming at you again with another video from another article. And this is the article for our first songs on the violin. Okay, so I'm going to kind of jump right into it here. Our first song is Walking Along. Walking Along. Now, uh, what I did is I gave you the string and then I gave you the finger number on it. Okay, I also included the actual sheet music for it. Now, we haven't gotten there. We I haven't taught you that. So it's expected that you're not really necessarily going to know how to read it, but that's okay because you can read the strings and you can read the fingers that are used. Remember that you're going to be putting your first finger on the yellow tape, your second finger on the red tape, your third finger on the blue tape, your fourth finger on the orange tape, which won't be using the fourth finger just yet. Remember that zero is open string. Okay, so now let's jump into walking along. Play along with me if you'd like. Uh, or do it afterwards, it's okay. Uh, but here we go, ready? Walking along. One, two, three, four. Okay, very simple. That's a good easy one to do. Let's go on to the next one. That's walking higher, okay? Walking higher. Here we go. One, two, three, four. and that's walking higher okay uh, now moving on we're gonna go to fun in the Sun fun in the Sun here we're going to combine a string D string a little bit more okay so that you can kind of get the feel of walking through both strings and uh, prepare you for some more difficult songs here we go one two three four I lowered my violin a little bit so that you could see the fingers, okay? Remember, you're following along with the string letter, okay? And then the finger number. So D0 would be the open D string. Uh, D2 would be the second finger on the red tape on the D string, okay? Uh, D1 would be the first finger on the first tape of the D string, okay? So you get the idea. And if you missed that, go ahead and go on back to some of the previous articles in stage two here, and it will tell you exactly what fingers go on which tape, where the tapes are, so on and so forth, because we're using the don't fret finger locator system, okay? Uh, that was fun in the sun. Final thoughts here, um, remember to practice every day, okay? Remember to practice every day, uh, at least 15 to 20 times a day, okay? Because that's what we need. We need repetition to help you stick it in your brain. Remember, muscle memory is what we're trying to generate here, okay? Let's so try that. Again, if you've forgotten or you don't know where to place your fingers, uh, go back to the articles. I uh, got some links there to go to the other article pages on where to place fingers on the D string, where to place finger on the A string, um, so I can help you uh, get back to that and then come back into this article and follow us into the next one, okay? So that you're good to go on where those fingers are supposed to be. All right, practice hard. Um, sometimes I know it can take some time, but it's totally worth it. You're going to be making even more beautiful music soon enough, okay? All right, so have a great day, and music is magic.